Hello, FSFE, and congratulations from the year 2041 on your 40 years of fighting for the digital rights of Europeans and of all people in all places. It's been a couple of crazy decades since I spoke to you last at your 20th. Uh, in those two decades, we have seen massive decentralization of the internet, thanks in part to uh, deep reforms to our antitrust and monopoly law, mandates for interoperability and open APIs, and of course the changes in our economic system that arose from the great crises that we've endured over the past two decades. Floods, fires, famine, refugee crises, all of the pandemics that we've lived through. And it was only by realizing that we had to cooperate rather than compete, that we had to expose our technical infrastructure to outside scrutiny and to outside improvement if we were going to survive crisis after crisis after crisis, that we were able to finally orient ourselves and our economy and our political project and our technological project towards weathering the storm that we had all seen coming, but that no one seemed able to confront. And after all, that turned out to be the difference, the difference between crisis and, uh, and, and uh, a happy ending between dystopia and utopia was not whether the heat that we had sunk into the ocean would melt the poles at will, not whether our coastal cities would drown, they have, not whether the wildfires would rage, they did, but whether when they arose, when, they arose, when these crises came to us, we confronted them head on or continued to deny them continued to pretend that we could lock up technical knowledge behind proprietary walls, that we could lock up control of technological systems in the hands of four or five digital robber barons who insisted that no government had jurisdiction over them and that they were accountable to no one except their shareholders. Once we realized that, once we embraced the ethic of collective work for a better future for our species, then we were able to turn the tide, not by averting the crises that were already set in motion, but by addressing them when they arose. Thank you, FSE, for the work that you did on that. And thank you to all the organizations allied with us around the world who joined to make that reality happen.